Hello, this is Dr. Gay from First Look MRI, and this is a 46-year-old male with complaints of knee pain from about five months. He'd had an injury, and since the injury, his knee has uh, been weak, and uh, this is a side view. We call this a sagittal view of the knee. We can see the femur, the big thigh bone here. We see the kneecap in front, and down here below, we see the tibia. And so the kneecap glides along here, and it has two things that attach it um, to the muscle. So up high, we have the quadriceps tendon that comes down to attach to the top of the kneecap. And down below the kneecap, we have the patellar tendon that comes down here to attach to the tibia. So it's called the quadriceps tendon and patellar tendon. And he has a tear, a chronic tear of this quadriceps tendon. And the kneecap usually sits higher. There's a line here. Uh, where the physis is fused, the growth plate is fused. Normally the kneecap is right about centered here, so you can see that it shifted down significantly. That's because this quadriceps tendon is torn. Now in this view it's a little bit difficult to appreciate, but the quadriceps tendon is usually pretty thick and strong, and here it looks pretty attenuated. If we come over here you can see this gray area, this is just scar tissue. If we come over to this view you can see the quadriceps tendon coming up. It looks like it stops abruptly there, so it's just a high grade partial or complete tear, almost completely torn. And I'm going to put up another view. This will show up a little bit better. So this is another sequence where the tendon will look darker. So this is the patellar tendon. Looks like it's um, recoiled a little bit upon itself because the kneecap is dropped down. And this is that quadriceps tendon. And right here is where it ends. So it's a, a high grade partial to complete tear. Some of the fibers on the edge may be intact, some limited fibers, but really it's a non-functioning torn quadriceps tendon allowing the kneecap to drop down and accounting for his anterior knee pain and weakness. And that's it. Thank you very much.